he's made all the right uh, speeches, the, you know, touching agriculture, touching various sectors. So I think he's tried to address all the constituents uh, right. and that's his job and he has a tough job to do. And I think within the constraints, uh, without raising taxes, uh, without cutting expenditure too much, although uh, as uh, Mr. Nalal said, that mm -hmm. he's tried to guise uh, or, or present uh, the increase as if there's a major increase, uh, but there is some increase. So I think if you look at it as a tough job in an election year, balancing so many constituents, I think he's done that balancing act very well. As I was mentioning, uh, the real analysis can be done once we've seen the fine print, which mm -hmm. we haven't done, uh, but he's made very neutral statements. Uh, there are some very obvious uh, expected uh, changes like surcharge for super rich or increasing the tax rate on SUVs. I mean, these have been in the press for uh, more than a year. So some of these changes were well expected and have been done. But we still need to see what the real fine print is because I'm sure there is a fair bit of news out there. The budget has been overall the expected lines. There's no major surprises. Same way there is no major, major transformational changes too. And purely from the healthcare sector, it's a bit uh, disappointing for us because we have been asking for the infrastructure sector for status for quite some time. That has not happened. Again, from medical technology side, we have been a more than 70-80% import-dependent industry. We have been asking for local incentives for local manufacturing and innovation. That has also not happened. So overall, overall, I don't think healthcare has been given that kind of a focus. Well, the general view is obviously it's an expected budget, um, the, uh, you know, given the fiscal deficit which has been there, but I cannot comment on general. I think the budget has been very balanced budget. As the finance minister promised that he is going to be uh, he's more concerned about the growth, he's more concerned about the stability of the tax regime, he's more concerned about the, uh, the stability of the entire fiscal policies, etc. I think to that an extent he has delivered on that part. Our general opinion is that it's a, it's a good, stable, mature budget, which is what we would expect from our mature finance minister, who's given several budgets before. And it's good to see that, that uh, the focus very clearly this year has been on growth. No major changes, okay? but uh, you know, major, some of the concerns, which are macro kind of thing, like fiscal deficit and all that, they have been addressed. Budget in view of the election, for the coming election next year, this is balanced budget. He has not put burden on the poor and middle class. In fact, he has raised the surcharge on the higher income group, one crore and above. That is a welcome step.